hello, hello. Well, it is midweek, the second week in January, and um, I can't believe we're 12 days into January. <laughs> Time does fly. But I just wanted to hop on for our weekly community care meditation. And um, last week we talked about um, crossing the threshold um, as we started the new year on um, last Wednesday. And this Wednesday, I wanted to talk about awakening rest. <laughs> and I wanted to open up with a poem by Georgia Douglas Johnson, who is a who was a poet and also a playwright during the Harlem Renaissance. And sh this poem is entitled Gilead. And she simply says this, walk within thine own heart's temple, child, and rest. What you seek abides forever in thy breast. Closer than the folded arm, is the soul renewing balm. Walk within thine own heart's temple, child and rest. And so what I wanted to do was kind of like talk about just tuning in and ask a question that my sister friend always asked me, how is your heart today? And that's just a simple question, and we're just going to sit with that. Um, maybe it's one word. Maybe it's many things. Are you feeling inspired in the heart? Are you looking forward to something within the heart? Are you joyful? What is your joy? Maybe perhaps you're learning something, you're going through something, and while you can't quite see what the lessons are, you know that there is much to learn as you go through. So just a heart check-in. How's your heart? And just take a moment at the end of Wednesday, for some of us, some of us are beginning our day in terms of possibly working at night. Some of us are in between shifts, perhaps. Whether you're watching now or watching later. And then some of us are coming to a close of our uh, work day. So again, I ask you the question, how is your heart at this moment, at this time? And perhaps that's a little scary to kind of tap in, and that's okay. That's all right. We make space for that. We make space for any emotion that may come up. And so that's what we're going to do. We're going to sit and just kind of tap in to our heart center and rest there. Rest there for a while and just see what begins to come to us. Allowing for space to tend to our heart. And so the idea is wherever we are on our path, whatever our days may look like in terms of Perhaps the texture of it, <laughs> the feel of our days, which is very vast and can run the spectrum. Um, whatever it is that we are moving in and through, the heart seeks to unfold in that experience. And sometimes because of what we're going through, it causes for a lot 
But in the same vein, um, the heart guides us when we really listen to it. And so what I'm gonna do is just invite you to get comfortable <laughs> wherever you may be at at this time. Just get comfortable in a seated position and just allow yourself to get as comfortable as possible. Do whatever you need to do. The most important thing is that you are safe wherever you may be, and there is a sense of comfort. So grabbing whatever support that you may, may need. So if you're sitting in a chair, definitely get as comfortable as possible. If you're lowered to the ground and you're choosing to be on the ground, that's fine as well. And if you're in the bed, that's totally fine as well. And so wherever you're at, I'm going to invite you to take a deep breath in through the nose, exhaling out. And you may be exhaling out through the mouth, but let's try taking a deep breath in through the nose and then exhale out through the nose. Let's do that one more time. Deep breath in through the nose. Exhale out through the nose. And then just returning back to your natural rhythm of breath. And I'm going to invite you to take your dominant hand and place it on your heart and your other hand to place it on your belly button. Middle of your stomach. And eyes may be open or shut, whatever your preference is. If your eyes are open, maybe take it at a soft gaze looking down. Again, the idea is for you to be as safe as possible. And we're just gonna in tune with our heart. We've crossed into the threshold of 2022. This idea of crossing into a new door. And I don't know about you, but my uh, grandparents and even my parents always had a chair by usually the back door, the side door, to have a seat. So I want you to visualize this idea again, as we talked about last week, crossing the threshold. And then visualize having a seat after you've come in, resting your coat. <laughs> have a seat there. And I want you just to connect and notice your breath. We're just gonna take a pause. And as you breathe, feeling the rise and fall of your chest, the rise and fall of the stomach, just on your natural breath. Notice the quality of your breath. And now returning back to the inhale through the nose. Exhale out through the nose. Inhale through the nose. 
Exhale out through the nose. You might even tune in to the sound of your breathing. And just continue that. Allowing it to be your anchor. Allowing it to ground you. Whether that be the breath or the simple touch of your hand against your chest and your stomach. Allowing that to ground you. And then, now on the inhale, when you breathe in, send the breath down to your heart. You may want to visualize it. You may even feel it. But on the inhale, breathing in and on the exhale, energetically, visually sending that breath to your heart. And then on the inhale, bringing the breath out, back up, perhaps up to your third eye in the middle of your brow. And exhale out. Inhale in. Exhale, send the breath down to the heart. Inhale in, taking the breath back up in between the brow and then exhale out. Just continuing to breathe. Now just release that practice and we'll sit here for the next two minutes just in complete silence of you just in tuning with your heart. Resting in your heart's temple as the poem goes. You sitting right next to the door that you just crossed over. Perhaps it's a door of opportunity, door of joy, the door of peace, the door of abundance. Tuning in to your breath. Tuning in to the sensation of your hand against your heart. Your hand against your stomach.
deep listening. To your unique melody. To the unique language of your heart. Feel yourself soften. Feel the shoulders relax a little bit more. Feel the jaw not as rigid or tight. Feel the cheeks relaxed, eyes relaxed, brow relaxed. Continuing to focus on the heart, your heart. And as you focus, what message can you tell your heart? What do you need to tell it? At this moment, this time, having crossed into 2022. If it's the door of peace, perhaps just simply saying, I am peace. Door of joy, I am joy. If it was the door of abundance, perhaps I am abundance. Mm, I am brave. Yes, I am brave. I love that. And with that word, I want you to visualize that taking up your entire heart. I am loving, yes, <laughs> I love it. I am brave, I am loving. Mm. And just visualize your heart just growing stronger with knowing that you are brave. You embody brave. You embody love. It is the very essence of you, the very essence of your heartbeat. You embody peace. You are peace. You embody abundance. You are abundance. And you know this by just simply resting in your heart's temple. Resting there. A knowing and in knowing you embody 
and you be that. You are that. You move as that. You move as being brave. You move as being loving. You move as being peaceful. You move as being abundant. Continuing to breathe and take in these affirmations, speaking to your heart. Continuing to breathe. So I ask you, like I asked at the beginning, how is your heart today? And as Georgia Douglas says in her poem, walk within thy own heart's temple, child, and rest. What you seek abides forever in thy breast. Closer than the folded arm is the soul renewing balm. Walk within thy own heart's temple, child, and rest. Awakening rest of the heart. And when you're ready, only when you're ready, taking a deep inhale through the nose, exhale out through the nose. Let's do that one more time. Deep inhale in through the nose, exhale out through the nose, but I'm gonna have you add a hum. Hmm. Let's do that one more time. Deep inhale through the nose. Exhale out through the nose, but adding a hum. Mm. And when you're ready, slowly releasing the practice. And you can stay right here. if you so choose. And as we close out the practice, grace and peace be in you. Grace and peace be all around you. Continue to be well, continue to be safe, and continue to take care. Thank you for joining me for community care meditation. <laughs> and I will hopefully see you next week. But until we meet again, be well. Thank y'all for joining. Thank you, cousin. <laughs> hey, Denise. Hey, Darlene. <laughs> Thank you for joining. <laughs>